Welcome to Studio Biology. In this video, we are going to discuss the differences between racemose and cymose inflorescence. In racemose inflorescence, the growing point rarely ends in flower. That is, it continues to grow. It means that it shows indefinite or indeterminate growth. While in case of cymose inflorescence, the growing point always forms a flower. That is it terminates in a flower and this type of growth is termed as definite or determinate growth. Flowers. Flowers arise laterally. Their arrangement is either acropetal or centripetal. Centripetal arrangement is termed when the flowers are in groups and flowers are rarely in groups while in case of cymose inflorescence flowers are terminal These are arranged, that is arrangement is either basi petal or centrifugal. Centrifugal arrangement is observed if the flowers are in groups. And in case of cymose inflorescence, flowers are commonly in groups. Next difference is that the peduncle or floral axis is monopodial while in case of cymose inflorescence the floral axis is sympodial or multipodial. These are the various points of differences between a racemose and cymose inflorescence. Thanks for watching this video.